You know the nursery rhyme about all the king's horses. In Britain yesterday, the queen won a big prize at Royal Ascot. No other king or queen has done that. As Charlie Daggett reports, it happened on a very traditional and colorful racing day. As the old song sort of goes, what a smashing, positively dashing spectacle, Ladies' Day at Royal Ascot. It's an annual week of horse racing outside London, but especially on Ladies' Day, darling, it's a lot less about the horses than the look at me hats. I don't know any of the horses. I don't even know how many races there are, but we're going to win some money, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> The fashion stakes run higher than the betting stakes, where styles range from modest fascinators to more outrageous designs. Well, they've banned all promotional and branded outfits, so you haven't got people coming up with kind of bananas on their head like they used to for the banana board, which was a problem in times past. But this year, I've seen people with practically entire sort of horticultural exhibitions on their head. I don't know how they're getting through the doors. But when it comes to making a grand entrance, no one can upstage the queen, who just happened to have a horse in this race. She wore lilac to match her horse estimates racing colors. Horses have been her passion all her life, and she would never miss Royal Ascot. To have a horse good enough to run in the prestigious Gold Cup is one thing, to have a chance of winning it is another. Her Majesty's public displays of emotion are exceedingly rare, but as her horse came from behind and charged closer to the finish line, there was no holding back either one. With her, quite frankly, unrestrained racing manager at her side, the Queen cheered as her horse crossed the line and the Queen rode into history. She became the first reigning monarch to win the Gold Cup in its 207-year history. She also pocketed around $225,000. Not a bad day at the races. For CBS This Morning, I'm Charlie Daggett in London. I think the Queen's having a very good year. She's yeah. had lots of celebration. She has a new grandchild coming, yeah. a new great-grandchild coming. It's I love Charlie's year. line, Her Majesty's public d displays yeah. of emotion are exceedingly, exceedingly rare. rare. Yes. It was also a good opportunity just to show the pictures of all those fascinators. Yes. They're yes. beautiful hats. Not everybody can carry off a hat, but they did it very well.